Hi everyone, welcome to another stationery and art supplies haul. These are from London stationery shops and specialty shops. I hope you enjoy! First up is from Alice Through the Looking Glass shop. They mostly give away free postcards like this one and free stickers. Next is a passport size notebook. I love the illustration on the cover. It has the rabbit and the Cheshire cat at the back. It's a passport size, so the theme is passport related. It also has illustrated pages with these cards and tips for travelers at the back. I'm going to check if this will fit my traveler's notebook passport size later. Next are these brass page markers. I love the illustration style that they used on these book minders. And I would probably make some stickers around the Alice in Wonderland theme. Probably similar to this and I'll print them on craft paper. Now let's test if this will fit. It fits but it's now too thick. Let's try this one. I think it's too fragile for a notebook. So I would probably use this to, to design pages on a bookshelf. Next are some stuff from um, Tate Modern Museum. My primary goal was for my friend to get me the pin that V from BTS wore but they were out of stock so my friend got me these instead and they are equally as cute although not the same as what V was wearing And the packaging is cute. These are just the cutest earrings. And I love that they are different for each ear. This will be great gifts for your artist friends. Next is of course from the Harry Potter shop. I got a charm that I, I've already added to my Pandora bracelet and a golden snitch necklace. Next are these assortment of pencils. Next is from the Choosing Keeping Shop. Again, free postcards. And this is a pencil extender. 
mainly I'm going to use this for my color pencils, but let's test this out. Polychromos doesn't fit. Of course, the lumin luminance will not fit as well. So let's try the Prisma color. I sharpen my Prisma colors a lot, so this works best for my Prisma colors. Next is an assortment of pencils again. A couple of Black Queen pencils and a couple of Choosing Keeping pencils. Next, stop the London Graphic Center shop. I got art supplies and these Midori clips or page markers similar to the Alice in Wonderland page markers. Next is this mechanical pencil that will fit my new red leads that I can't seem to find in any of the art supplies and stationery stores here in Dubai. Next is this watercolor notebook journal sketchbook. I don't own this size so it will be interesting to use a different size of canvas for my watercolor painting or maybe wash or ink. Next is this single item from the Moon Skin Shop. It's a initial that you clip that you clip on your moleskin notebook like this. It's a bit tight, but I think it's just because my moleskin is already old. Next is from L. Cornelison and Son Shop. This is a dream shop. I got the finally I got this roller and clinger liquid watercolor. I have yet to try their ink set, but I'm really excited to try these. These were the only colors they have available, so I didn't manage to get the colors that I wanted from their online, from checking their online shop, but it's fine next time. Now we head on to the books that I got from the house of Minalima shop. These are signed books. Of course, I got the Alice in Wonderland interactive book. So much to explore inside this book with all its interactive elements mostly made of paper. And of course, their recently released book the magic of Mina Lima. It's about the details and the design they created for the Harry Potter movies and the Fantastic Beast movies. There's a lot of inspiration inside this book and a lot of behind the scenes.
and of course a couple of beautiful cards that I mostly just put on my wall. Next is from the Moomin shop. First, I got a bag. It's a small bag. I love the lining. Matches the aesthetic of Moomin. I love the green shade of this lining. And of course, the illustration in front. Next is an addition to my Oliver Jeffers book collection. Let me know which ones are your favorite in the comments and I might just send you uh, several of my sticker sheets or um, stickers as long as the shipping to your city and country doesn't cost an arm and a leg. I hope you enjoy watching and I hope you find inspiration in the stationary books and other stuff that I showed you today.